Okay, we're going to do a little demonstration today on how to change out a drive dog on a Mark VI extender or intra. And the drive dog area on the extender and intra are identical, so we're using the extender today. And the first thing we want to do is reach in the back of our machine and turn it off. And the second thing is, let's pull the power cord completely out of the machine and lay it aside. That way we know we're fully safe. Okay, and to give us working room in our extender here, we're going to remove all the modules. And we have a lot of small pieces involved in the drive dog. So to keep from losing small pieces in our chemical tank, <clears throat> we pre-cut a little piece of cardboard here and going to lay it right across our tank. It covers the developer fixer and water. And on the intro, you'll be removing all three tanks and modules and you won't have to deal with the cardboard thing because uh, if you drop anything it won't be uh, into chemistry. And we're going to work on the fixer one here for demonstration today. And all four of your drive dogs are identical the way they uh, in shape and operate. And to get started, we simply grasp the outside of our bonnet, the uh, light color piece here, and we're going to turn it counterclockwise less than a quarter of a turn. And after we turn it a quarter turn, outwards it comes. Right behind that, we have our drive dog. And that's one easy piece to drive, drop into chemistry, but we got it safely today. Third piece, we got our spring right here. And then the last part of a drag doll assembly is a flat stainless steel washer in the back here. But that seldom comes out with the other pieces. And our main shaft here, which is D-shaped in design, never can come out <coughs> from this side of the uh, machine. So, on reassemble, we're just going to carefully look in there and make sure our stainless steel washer is back on our shaft. And then we're going to do a little observation here on uh, the opening. We have a little notch at 12 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and 2 o'clock. And we're using only the 8 o'clock and 2 o'clock that correlate with the tabs on our bonnet as we reassemble. So the first piece we're going to put back in is our spring. Simply slides over the shaft. And then we take our drive dog and make sure that our bow tie shape drops into the bonnet. That's the, the way it ha is reassembled. This has to face outward and on the inside is a D shape that goes on this shaft. So now we're going to line up those tabs at 8 o'clock, 2 o'clock, right there. And then we have to take our finger and turn the drive dog until it engages with that D shaft, hold in on the bonnet and turn it clockwise about a quarter turn or less, and we're fully reassembled. And we have a spring action on our drive dog, which is proper, and it sticks out about a quarter inch past the bonnet. And that's our simple reassemble of our drive dog, and we're ready to go.